Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to go over how to delete a block. This is going to be a fairly straightforward video. It's going to be quick and simple, so let's hop into it. Real quick, before we get into the video, subscribe to the channel, turn your notifications on, and if there's anything you want to see, leave it in the comments. I would love to make another future video about it. Alright, so here we have a basic office setup and you have three offices or two offices in one big conference room or board members room, whatever you want to call it. But we have multiple blocks within this office. So if I hover over any of these objects, like right here, you'll see that everything selects at once or everything is all selected, right? So that's all of these and these are all blocks. Now to insert a block, what you're going to want to do is you're going to go up to block, the block box up here underneath the home tab and you're going to click insert. It's going to take you to all your blocks and you can kind of expand this if you want. But say we want to insert this, we do that. We just, you know, left click and it's inserted. But what is not as clear is how to delete a block. So you go to create. It's obviously not going to be in a create because you want to delete it. If you go to edit, I can click on any of the blocks like that. Click OK. But it's just going to take me to the block editor. So we're going to close this. And... One important note, if you want to delete a block, you have to delete it from the drawing. So in this example, we want to get rid of this massive uh, conference room table thing. We want to put a new one in there. I don't like the way this looks. So we are going to go ahead. We're going to delete it from the drawing. Then we're going to go up to the left-hand corner in the AutoCAD button, upper left, left click. And then we're going to click on the drawing utilities right here. And then we're going to come over and click on Purge. Now we want to make sure that this Purge is under Purgeable Items right here. And we want to make sure that it's not all selected. We don't want to purge everything. We just want to purge the blocks. So unselect everything. And then we can go right here to this little plus sign. Left click. And you're going to find that piece of furniture is underneath there. So we're going to left click on the furniture. And then we're going to come down here to Purge Checked Items. We're gonna, it's gonna give this a little air. We're going to purge this item. And then we are going to close the window. Now, as you can see, if I come up to the insert box underneath the block box, it's going to give me three items instead of two. So this last one is obviously just a chair. I have this one right here, which is a bigger version of that. And then you have this little guy right here but it does not give me a chance to put that conference room table back in. The other way you can do this too is, let's delete these blocks real quick. And the other way you can do this, say I don't want these blocks in here. I wanna get rid of these, we're gonna delete them. I can type in purge right there, left click, and all of a sudden it's gonna show me to the block area and I can, um, Purge checked items, purge this item, and there we go. It's all purged. So that is how you delete slash remove a block. Thank you for watching the video. Again, I said it before, but if you have any other comments or anything you want to see, please leave them below, and I will see you in the next one.